So here I am, I've got about a 30 yard shot left. This is really common for everybody who's watching this at home. This is what happens to you too. From the fairway, the most important thing to do, choose the spot very wisely where you want this ball to land. So with some experience, I know that it's really easy to walk up to the hole, take a look here, and then even get behind the hole so I can get a general layout of the green. I can feel it in my feet and see it right here when I'm taking a look that the ball is gonna tend to roll this way down towards the valley. So I'm gonna choose a spot that's up here to try to land this shot with just my normal 58 degree wedge. There's no reason to try to play a tricky shot like a little seven iron here. Those aren't any easier. Those aren't shots you practice, don't do it. Looking back once or twice, I can really check my work and I feel pretty comfortable that that's where I'm gonna land it. Technique wise, the only thing I'm gonna make sure I do is open the face enough so that I can uh, use the bottom of the club to help me launch this into the air. And let's see how I do. It's about right, a little left of the spot I wanted to aim, and the result is just left of the hole, but really good, I can tap that in for par. For help with this or any part of your golf game, find a local golf tech coach near you.